those new allegations against Matt Lauer. Variety reporting on an excerpt from Ronan Farrow's new book, Catch and Kill, which details an on-the-record accusation of rape against Lauer from a producer who worked with him at the Sochi Olympics in 2014. Eva Pilgrim is here with the story. Good morning, Eva. Good morning, George. That producer coming forward in Farrah's new book with detailed claims of how the alleged assault happened while she was traveling on assignment. Ronan Farrow's new book, Catch and Kill, which details his investigation into Harvey Weinstein, as well as his attempts to get his then-employer, NBC News, to broadcast the story. Now, new allegations surfacing about former Today Show anchor Matt Lauer, who was fired from NBC in 2017 for alleged sexual misconduct. According to Variety, which obtained excerpts from the book, a former NBC News producer who worked with Meredith Vieira has come forward identifying herself in Farrow's book and stating that Lauer sexually assaulted her at the 2014 Sochi Olympics. According to the woman's account in Catch and Kill, Lauer joined her and Vieira for drinks and she ended up going back to Lauer's room twice. Once to retrieve her press credential and another because he invited her back to the room. Once in the hotel room, the woman says Lauer, who was wearing a t-shirt and boxers, pushed her against the door and kissed her, then pushed her onto the bed. According to the Variety excerpts from the book, she said she was in the midst of telling him no when he just did it. It hurt so bad. I remember thinking, is this normal? The woman telling Pharaoh it was non-consensual in the sense that I was too drunk to consent. It was non-consensual in that I said multiple times that I didn't want to. Back in New York City, according to the excerpts, the woman told Pharaoh she went on to have further sexual encounters with Lauer that were consensual. After the encounter, according to Catch and Kill, Pharaoh says she told colleagues and superiors at NBC, but nothing happened until she went to Meredith Vieira and told her what happened. Vieira urged her to go to NBC Human Resources with a lawyer. Matt Lauer responded to these allegations this morning, saying the story is filled with false details intended only to create the impression this was an abusive encounter. Nothing could be further from the truth. There was absolutely nothing aggressive about that encounter. This encounter, which she now falsely claims was an assault, was the beginning of our affair. NBC released a statement about the excerpts from Catch and Kill, saying Matt Lauer's conduct was appalling, horrific, and reprehensible. That's why he was fired within 24 hours of his first learning of the complaint. And the book also presents Pharaoh's account of his investigation into Harvey Weinstein and his efforts to get that story on the air at NBC. Eventually, he had to take the story to a magazine to get it published. George. Okay, thanks. Eva Ronan Farrow is going to be here live Friday morning for an exclusive interview. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.